Hi, I'm Tom and today I want to show you how to create packages for all supported platforms of your project. So at the beginning let's create a, simp a simple project. Let's start Blender and I will add Suzanne. Give her some color. Yeah, this should be enough for the beginning. Let's save it in the playground folder. So just um, browse there and uh, and go to the project folder, and there override the project blend. So now we can um, test. This is how it looks like in uh, Linux. Okay, now let's go to um, let's open um, the folder of the playground, and there you see a script called package all Linux. This is basically creating. This is a cr trying to create all packages that are supported. Let's have a look inside. <coughs> so here are some instructions. Basically it tells you have um, out of the box supported Linux and Windows. So if you are not installing additional SDKs or NDKs, your, um, this script is creating for you two packages, one for Windows and one for Linux. But if you want to create packages for Android, Mscripten or Web HTML or Blackberry, you need to install um, those SDKs or NDKs. Here are all um, URLs you need to, ha uh, to have to um, get started. Once you have installed all of those or the ones you want to, you have two options. You can set an environment variable to the root of those SDKs. For uh, mscripten it has to be the em SDK variable for BlackBerry 10, the BB, BB10 NDK, and so on. For Android, you have to set the Android Home and the Java Home. The Android Home is the, the root of the SDK. Okay. Now I want to show you how this works. Um, but I do it on the command line. So I call package or Linux. And here you can see it created for you the game kit Linux, Windows. Here it um, found mscripten and was able to create the game web for you as well. Here it created the APK using the Android SDK and last but not least the BlackBerry versions BB2, BB10 or Playbook. Going back to the folder you can see a new packet, uh, a new folder that is called package. If you go inside there are different folders and different um, packages. So the folders are basically game Linux. Um, this is the version. Um, yeah, here you can start immediately just by double clicking game. You are ready to go and see this is your game. Windows same and web also the same. In Android there are the APKs that are was um, were generated. 
further you see here the, um, <coughs> the APK you can use it is basically the same as this one it's just a copy and um, and all of the zip files are basically just the, zi the zipped versions of the folders okay let's say something about web web is very experimental um, in order to get it work you need to set certain flags on the browsers so for Firefox you need to enable an, a feature for this to work you have to use um, about config and as URL and then you can set JavaScript options shared memory to true this is as default false so it is not optimal for the usual end user and in Chrome you have to pass two command line options in order to work. I don't know on the Internet Explorer or I don't know if this is, is this working at all. I, I guess not. Okay. Um, something to say about the Android um, version. Here in Build Gradle you can see that it relies on the SDK version 24 and on the build tools version 2303 if those are not installed you can um, update here the versions you have or you can just install those versions for blackberry to work you need to alter the bar descriptor and you have to do it you have to set your author ID so that the signing is working. Yeah, basically this is it. I hope you enjoyed and see you later.